Welcome back to SourceFed. I'm Trisha Hirschberger. And I'm scared. I mean Steve. I mean petrified. Whatever. What Steve is trying to say is that there is some really freaking cool super futuristic news today. UC Berkeley neuroscientist Robert Knight has developed an implant chip that translates your thoughts into words that can then be sent to the internet to control machines. Yeah, chew on that for a sec. Trisha, does that mean you can use your brain to control machines? Is that what you're trying to say? Yeah. So it's like Magneto and Professor X had a baby? Sure. Flashback to 1998, Dr. Kevin Warwick from the University of Reading put an implant in his arm to control doors. Then in 2002, he planted electrodes in his nervous system to control a robotic arm. Then, stick with me now, he created the first brain-to-brain -brain direct communication by implanting a chip into his wife's arm. His wife would move her arm three times and Warwick would feel it in his brain. Creepy, really, really creepy. So besides being totally awesome and cool and creepy and blowing my mind, these types of neurological advances could be used to help people who can't speak to speak or people who've had a stroke or developed Parkinson's or Alzheimer's. Or to help us control robots using only our brains, Pacific Rim, Avatar. And some like Dr. Henry Markram, director of the Blue Brain Project, believes he'll be able to make a fake AI brain. All right, now I'm scared again. Okay, if I had a brain implant that could translate my brain signals to words, then I thought of Steve, and Steve thought that he would allow my brain to connect with his brain, then the data would transmit over, and he could see what I see, experience what I experience. Yeah, and then I could tell if you have weird nipples or not, because I don't know. Or vice versa, Trisha, you'd finally know what it's like to pee standing up, unless you pee standing up sometimes. I don't, so it would be a new experience. Uh, so what would you want to experience if this tech was here right now? Let us know in the comments down below. Hey, did you know that there's also a bar down here that you can click on? It's got like and subscribe, all sorts of different buttons. Wait, no, that's not a bar. <laughs> a bar is a place where you go to get drunk and forget about your worries. This is an annotations bar, though, and if you click on one of those, you can see videos on the other channels and this channel. I'm Steve Zaragoza. I'm Trisha Hershberger. Trisha, what am I thinking of right now? Ninja Turtles Pizza! Nope, I was thinking of Black Spider-Man. Is that racist? No. There's a Black Spider-Man. That's not his name, though. But I mean, he technically is a Black Spider-Man. Okay, fair enough. Because he's got a black suit on. He does. <laughs>